Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Hello if you're new. Today, as you can probably tell by the title, I'm joining you again for another purple shampoo video. Some of my favourites to film, I really enjoy them. And this one specifically is from Schwarzcroft. It's a live silver shampoo. It's a yellow neutraliser. It looks just like this. And I think I ended up picking this up from like Wilkinson's. I was buying a few home products and my unhealthy habit is always looking in the hair section of a shop. And I saw this and I realised I hadn't tried this product before. Super affordable, it was literally a couple of pounds. So I thought, let's pick this up and try it next because I've tried tons of purple shampoo so far this year and this one I felt like if it worked could be a great alternative if you're looking for something that is super affordable. So with that said and done, let's dive straight into the video. Before we go any further, be sure to click that subscribe button down below and don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. It really helps me understand what type of videos you guys like, if you like my purple shampoo review videos and also let me know down below if there's any products you'd like me to try next, specifically whether that's a purple shampoo or any other hair care product, I would love to hear from you. So this is on the front, it's for blonde, grey or white hair and it says get a silver reflex glow to your hair with the special formula with cold violet pigments and anti-yellow effect. Live silver shampoo fights against yellow undertones on your blonde gray or white hair the formula is silicone free your hair structure is strengthened rinse hair well after application so you apply the shampoo of course on wet hair leave on to foam for three to five minutes rinse thoroughly wash your hands after and just use regularly for best results in terms of preventing that neutralized effect so yeah this is basically what i'm going to be doing so i'm going to go and wet my hair but before we do that just have a little look at what my hair is looking like now obviously definitely more on the brass here as you can definitely tell here so because I have a balayage obviously I have all different types of like blonde running through my hair so in some areas it's a bit darker to add depth but also just at the ends there it's not as bright or as kind of reflective as I would like it to be and I just feel like you can definitely see like strong brassiness. Generally, I've not toned my hair for a little while. And so, yeah, I just feel like I could do with a bit of a refresh and see what it's looking like. So yeah, let me go and wet my hair and we'll apply this together. We'll see what the formula's like. And of course the results at the end of this video. So my hair's been just like dampened through and I'm gonna go and try this product. Let's see what the color is first and foremost. If you've watched any of my other videos, you will know that my expectation is to have a really rich pigmented product to know that this is going to work. Normally when you lather it a little bit, you lose that pigment, but wow. <laughs> this I feel like is going to work. The smell also just hit me then. It's a really fresh smell. It's not too insulting, but there's definitely a fragrance there. What I do with these is I coat all of my hair in terms of just like covering and doing a bit of a purple mask almost in terms of covering where I need the pigment the most and as you lather it you're going to lose that even more so I tend to leave it move on to the other side this does go everywhere so I would definitely recommend doing this in a shower and not in front of a white wall <laughs> um, and I'm just gonna cover this like this and as you can see there that purple pigment is fully saturated. So when it goes a bit more sudsy, it kind of diffuses a little, but still I've had purple shampoos that do that, that then perform so excellently. So that you can see there in terms of the color, it's definitely left like a cool shine onto my hair. So again, on this side, and I bring this right up because obviously my roots, I don't want to be like really warm with the contrast of really cool ends. I have a balayage, so my blonde typically starts from here down. It's got tons of different blondes in it, but I find that purple shampoos are a necessity for me in regards to keeping my hair nice and bright. Well, wow, that's looking nice and perfectly there. This is actually lathering so much better than some other affordable ones I've tried. And it's kind of mimicking high-end ones too, which I love. This is literally a couple of pounds, like I said, from Wilkinson's. So love that. I'll try and have it linked down below too, so you can have a little look. But that's looking so good. Let's give it another massage in. I just wanted to bring you a little bit closer so you can just see how purple that still is on my hair. Obviously compared to like my hands, it's definitely diffused quite a lot, but there's still a 
a purpley blue kind of tone in terms of those bubbles on my hair which is going to work in terms of like toning my hair and removing those brassiness and the same on this side too you can see like on the lightest strands where that purple pigment is most evident yeah this looks like it's gonna be really good said to leave on for three to five minutes and then rinse thoroughly wash your hands after use i wonder why it's saying that because honestly my hands are super stained and i forgot to take off my rings oops so i'm gonna leave this on now for yeah about five minutes i normally leave it to the maximum sometimes with these i normally double the time so i would probably like next time leave this on for 10 minutes but i want to follow the instructions so you guys know what you'll get in terms of following that and then at the end depending on how toned my hair is i'll let you know whether or not i would recommend leaving it on for longer the next time and if you're looking for a starting point always do a bit of a test strand or if you're going to leave it on but want to leave it on for longer just keep an eye on it you can kind of move the product out of the way and see what your hair's looking like underneath so yeah you can do that but i'm going to go and jump in the shower in about five minutes time and i'll be back once my hair is all washed and dried we will see how well this has worked and if it's worth picking up so i'm back and i feel like it's definitely done something compared to my before i feel like my hair was a lot more brassy slightly more yellow toned and definitely had a bit of an orange shift in terms of the ends mid lengths that's where i want the most enhancement in terms of brightening i feel like this after definitely reflects more of life to my hair it's a bit brighter i don't think it's the most dramatic in terms of before and afters but i definitely feel like this has done something and it's definitely made the ends look a little bit more cool and slightly silvery so yeah i definitely feel like there is a bit of a difference i feel like there's a lot more coolness in the mid lengths to ends and generally i feel like my hair just looks so much better in terms of refreshed yeah i actually really like this and i think that for the price this is a really really affordable product to try especially if you have blonde hair that you're just looking more as a preventative more so than a cure in terms of your hair going brassy i would say you could probably use this more often than not because my hair even after using this is super hydrated and actually feels really really good in terms of not feeling dry whilst also still achieving this kind of level of toning so i'm actually really impressed with this considering i bought this on an absolute whim i think the this is a great product to check out, especially if you have lightened hair or even if you have silver hair too. I think that this is great in terms of preventing it looking too kind of grey and dull. So yeah, what do you guys think? I hope that you agree. Um, my hair is still super wet from when my hair was wet, but we move. I'd love to know what you guys think. And if there's any other products similar to this that you want me to try out next, I would love to know. Just leave them down below in the comments. I love trying your suggestions. And some of the best suggestions and products have come from ones that you guys have told me to try. So honestly, thank you so much. And if you do have any, leave them down below. I love hearing from you. It makes my day, honestly. I reply to all of my comments. So even if you want to say hello, have a little chat feel free i'll be down there to reply but yeah i hope you've enjoyed the video i i'm actually so impressed with this again not super dramatic it's not lifting my hair i feel like it's definitely given it a bit more life and it's also like added great amounts of shine and it feels incredible honestly it feels so conditioned so that's a bit of a rarity when it comes to purple shampoo so yeah i'm really pleased i tried this and i hope you guys have a fantastic rest of your day be sure to subscribe and like this video and do all the youtube things it really helps me out and i'll see you guys in my next one bye